what is going on people welcome to a new video here on the channel um we did a lord beta data from video uh, a few weeks ago i think one or two weeks ago where we used the attack at level six today we're going to be using the level six for the support which i think in my opinion is even better going up against this kenobi crazy cron so as we can see here we're going to go up against uh this kenobi where they have all the best stuff for the Decron and also really good stuff for their um extra stats as you can see here's the lineup we have piet tarkin and fifth brother as many support characters as we have because of this so every time a supporting fix a debuff we're going to get extra critical damage for our attackers and our supporters is going to get 10 percent extra potency so without further ado let's just get straight into the battle and let me showcase you how you should do this battle it's pretty similar to how you did uh do the other battle that I just showcased uh, in a video a few weeks ago um but yeah just to show again we have the same data grounds Let's start off by doing a force uh, crush, not force crush, uncheck the motions. Increase cat's cooldown. So, uh, I'm not gonna do this right now. I'm just gonna mark down Lord Vader for now. Make sure Piet goes down the stealth so they didn't target him. And then the more times than often go for Tarkin, but that's alright. Uh, let's do this. And let's do that. And um, I'm not gonna use my 5 stack. I'm gonna use this for now once again. Um, now we're gonna use this. Let's see, we should be going into alt in a second. And um, perfect. And let's do that. Heal up our team a bit. He should be going into alt now as well. And there we go. Master Kenobi. Unfortunately, our Tarkin keeps getting ability blocked. Um, but it's alright, he should be coming around soon sooner rather than later let's keep doing this um, the reason I'm not using my five stack is because Kenobi has so many so much protection up it's not even worth it um, let's see now okay just do this and keep doing this maybe I should target Padme ah, it's probably all right um, let's see, let's just heal up the team a bit. Now we can do that, perfect. He gave that to Cat, I guess. She's probably gonna do a... Yeah, okay, she wasted it on uh, Lord Vader, which is a little bit odd. She normally goes for Maul when he has five stacks, but hey, it works out in our favor. I won't complain. So, let's just use the five stacks right here. I think it's a good opportunity to do so. Okay, so the more they're targeting my Lord Vader, the better it is for us. Unless they give him a healing immunity, but it's alright. Um, okay, so I'm just gonna do basic for now, because we can't heal and I want to save that um, unshacked emotions for something that you will see any second. Hopefully. Uh, okay, let's just heal up now. Let's not use that unshacked emotion just yet. Um, uh, one more turn, then we should be able to use it. And I will show you guys why we are waiting. Do this. Some more buffs. Do this and do that. Did we go for my marks? Okay. Okay. The timing is a little bit messed up. Oh shit. Now the damage on the ramp. So what I'm waiting for is for the bonus protection on Kenobi to go away. But every time Padme does a basic, he gains some protection up uh, again. So let's just see if we can time this out uh, as I want to. Which should be... Yep. Yeah, we should be right now. So no worries, guys. We'll get there. Now let's see. Yes. Now I just saw he had bonus protection on him. <laughs> As you can see, 1.5 million damage on that Kenobi. Let's see here if we can wrap this battle up. Um, I'm just gonna do this. I don't want to kill him off. Of course, we almost did. Uh, let's see. This has taken a little bit 
2.7 million damage guys so you can see this team is definitely <laughs> when lord vader ramps up that much it's crazy damage that comes with it three three million damage and this battle would have gone a lot quicker if i just didn't explain it which you will see uh, in some other videos or not some other videos but some more gameplay that I'm going to be posting so as you can see we do crazy amount of damage um, let me just see if there's someone that has a similar datacron okay so this guy has a similar datacron not so good stats so but I think it works fine for this one so not similar stats but similar uh, L3 and L6 and L9 or it is the same L6 L3, L6 and L9 um, so just walking you through it again to show you guys that this works all the time and that it took it just a little bit longer because I explained it so now I'm going to try and speed run it a little bit for you guys so to showcase you that it works without taking the full five minutes okay so now they are going for my mall maybe this on my previous battle so now uh, I'm just gonna use my full stacks because I want. Oh shit, now I missed one. Misplay for me. Uh, it's okay though. Let's do this. And do basic. Because that perch, we get some extra critical damage. And he, we almost triggered the savior right away. Let's just do an onshock of the motions right now. Make sure that Maul can get his five stacks back. the basic it's not gonna do much um, do this targeting my mall a bit okay nice we have the five stacks back mm, do this and do that and then we just do this again and no need to do that right now do an AOE we should be going out of alt with Lord Vader in a second. Okay, unfortunately they resisted it. Let's see if... Uh, we're, no, we're not going to be able to increase our cooldowns once again. So let's see who she targets. And targets. Uh, now we should be out of alt. Mark him down. Let's see. She went for mall this time. It's alright still. <clears throat> Do that. I resisted unfortunately. And do basic. They're going for my Tarkin. It's alright. It's alright. We can lose them. Let's see. Okay, we're ready for an alt with Lord Vader at least. Which is good. Let's see here. Okay, so now Kenobi is open a little bit earlier than expected. Let's see if we can get him out. 679,000 so not as clean as the previous one but, <laughs> but still compared to what uh, is clean up against this uh, team without with this datacron I'll take it uh, I'll take it any day I don't know what beats this team with perfect banners right now maybe SFKR with first order storm not stormtrooper but um, SF type pilot, pilot I, think it's, I think it is that level 9 datacron um, or maybe a mirror match, I don't know, to be to be honest, so I'll still take it, but now we just gotta make sure we keep ramping, these slots are not gonna die because they've just ramped so much extra potency, I don't know if that helps to be honest, but they must surely ramp something because they almost never die, uh, let's see if we can just get rid of this bonus protection soon. I'm just gonna put it on auto uh, but as you can see guys this is very consistent I've done it twice now up against two very similar um, Kenobi datacons I could do it let me just do it a third time so you don't think it is just now that I get lucky uh, let's see as soon as we get through that bonus protection you should be killing them off ref light ref left right and center what's going on with my English la 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 Okay, <laughs> let's target her. 
Uh, 2 million damage. Awesome. And she dies off, and now she is going to fall. She's, he's going to kill her wife again. 1.6 million damage. So, as you can see, very consistent. Now, this battle will lost two people. Let's just do a third time. So you guys don't think that I am trying to fool you, trying to clickbait or anything like that. Uh, let's see if we can find something similar. Okay, they had uh, him. Uh, let's see here. Okay, they don't have anything. Uh, this guy. Okay, so this guy has... Oh, but it's a Relic 7. Let's see if we can find something better. Um... Eight. No. Let's see. Nope. Um, uh, mm. Okay, they had a little bit better. Let's see. Okay, let's go for this team instead. So, third battle in a row now, guys. Just to showcase Lord Vader's power with this uh, particular data crumb. Uh, as you can see, we see a rock and everything the same. Nothing is edited. We're going to do exactly the same as we've been doing. Increase our cooldowns. I'm going to him. Do that. Mark Lord Vader down. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Trying to get some more buffs on them. Unfortunately, he gets stunned. Which sucks. It is what it is, though. Um, do this. Uh, let me just do this. It's not worth to change a winning concept. Um, get some more debuffs on them. Debuffs, debuffs, debuffs. Let's see. Uh, let's just heal up Tarkin a bit. Already at 200,000 damage, which is a whole lot. Uh, let's just do this again. And uh, let's just... Oh, nice. Tarkin came to play. I just keep targeting cat because I fear her insta kill uh, even though she might not have it but ah, I don't know it's better that I target her than I forget it and we just keep doing the same thing over and over again they're gonna do a few stuff here and there let's see okay they got lucky with that so let's see if she is smart and uses her insta kill on some of these guys instead of Lord Vader some lag and uh, we should be going out of alt she is ready for her insta kill let's see if she is smart and uses it on some of these guys but still we are still in a good spot to win this in my opinion we just gotta wait for that bonus protection to go off we are ready for yet another alt Okay, so you just used it on 5th brother, which is a pretty good choice. Um, keep doing this. Let's see if we're going to be have, have enough debuffs or enough stacking to kill off Kenobi with one hit. Since I've seen a lot of our stuff has been resisted. Let's see. Okay, not good timing. Let's just wait one more turn see if we can get this bonus protection on Kenobi off and there it goes let's see if we have enough and we do 750,000 as you can see guys even if you do lose two or three characters in the beginning it's still a pretty not easy I'm not gonna say it's an easy battle because it's not an easy battle but as long as you <laughs> time everything out correctly and do everything right, you should be winning this pretty comfortably. 700,000, 900,000, and just do this, and do that, and she should die off. Um, well guys, yeah, as I've said, uh, a lot of guys say that Lord Vader is not good at Galactic Legend, but maybe some guys don't know how to play with him correctly. Um, so I just showcased for you guys now three times in a row um, how to beat this particular um, Jedi Master Kenobi with this data concept that they have, this overpowered. 
data class set, to be honest, and going into 5v5 season of Grand Arena. This might be helpful for some of you guys, or maybe it won't be. Uh, for those of you that wonder how I mod my Lovid, I mod him for critical damage and health, with a focus on a lot of offense on my secondary. So you can see 5.4, 3.8, here we went for offense, we have 6.89 offense right here, and we have offense right here as well. If you take a look at all of the stats combined, um, let's see, what am I doing? Like this, we do have roughly 14,000 uh, in physical offense, which helps out a lot, com a lot compared to if I were to use a, for example, uh, Lord Vader, let's see, uh, let's see, where is it, where is it, not this one. Um, me. Oh, okay, okay, I can't even show you guys. So, <laughs> uh, but what I was I was gonna say is, having this amount of offense or damage helps out a ton uh, instead of you're having like ten thousand damage, but you have a lot of speed and health protection. Because then Lord Vader is not going to ramp as much damage as he does now, and with this critical damage also, we gain. Uh, to where is it? Where is critical damage? Critical damage? Critical damage? We gain 222% instead of the 192 if we're going to rock the speed and protection mod set. Um, so yeah, this is the way I'm using it. Nobody seems to like it except me and a few others that uh, are following on my channel. Uh, but I recommend you giving it a go if you really want to experience the best with Lord Vader. And for the data crown once again. Uh, I think it's this one. We have a lot of critical damage and defense. Mostly one roll of the other in each of these. The level 9 does not matter at all. Uh, I think because there's no level 9 that they can use with Lord Vader for this one. Maybe Garth Saxon, but he is not a support character from what I can remember. Let's see. Yeah, only Dark Knight. So, no level 9 to really use with Lord Vader. So, I recommend crit damage, defense, or crit damage, or and um, protection um, but yeah guys I think that's going to be it for this video I'm going to try and uh, not try I'm going to leave some extra gameplay of Lord Vader uh, up against Jedi Master Kenobi with this um, mod setup and the data count that I used uh, feel free to like and subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you guys in the next video have a beautiful day guys peace out actually I sorry <laughs> I saw that this video is already too long so <laughs> I'm not gonna do any extra gameplay of the Lord Vader I think three battles in a row uh, is showcasing you guys that Lord Vader really can do this. Have a good day. Bye.